Hello, Princess Peach. Pleased to meet you. My name is Twig. <laughs> <laughs> Twink! You poor star. Why not Twinkle? Like Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Why is your name Twink? Oh, Lord. <laughs> hey guys, before this video begins, I just want to emphasize on the fact that this is a blind playthrough, and please do not share any spoilers. Don't hint towards upcoming events or areas or enemies or anything like that just let me enjoy the game fully blind however tips tricks and advice is always welcome so please help me out in the comments down below if you want to but other than that hopefully you guys enjoy my blind let's play series of paper mario Thanks, guys. Hello, my YouTube viewers. My name is Ganvius, and welcome to part three of my Let's Play series of Paper Mario. If we can hit 30 likes for part three, that would be absolutely insane. So, between last episode and this episode, I actually recorded a lost episode, I guess. I honestly didn't know what to call it, so I just called it the lost episode. It's more of like a bonus episode or filler or whatever. But basically, what I did is I decided, if you haven't seen the video, it's only 18 minutes long, I highly recommend that you watch it. But to give you a premise of that video, I decided to restart the game again and go back and tattle on all the enemies that I missed with Gumbario. I also took uh, all your guys' tips and tricks and advice into consideration and used that in that episode so yeah i basically was pausing the recording a lot and showing you guys the good stuff the new stuff and stuff that i overall didn't do but for the most part i did not progress in the game whatsoever i just literally got back to shooting star summit so my history right now is starting this let's play on an emulator and then i moved from the emulator to switch online and created file one as you can see <coughs> file one as you can see right here and then i decided to restart again and now i got file four so i just went from one to four so i don't get confused so that's why i didn't go from one to two or anything like that so yeah file four this is where we're going to continue off where we last left off and i'm going to again tattle on as many enemies as i can but if i forget some other little things um i do apologize i don't really have the intention to 100 percent literally every single little thing and look at every single little thing in my first playthrough it's my first time ever playing this game so without further ado enough rambling let's get right into it here we go huh oh sniffle sniffle Okay, hi, Peach. Mario's probably hurt. Nah, he's fine. Everyone's in prison. The Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if things continue the way they're going. Something must be done. If only somebody could help me. Oh. Uh-oh. Well, well, well. <laughs> My dear Princess Peach. How are you doing this fine day? There's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. We're so high above the sky right now. Even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. You know, Princess, as long as I have the star rod, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know, the power that grants everyone's wishes, it's mine. Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> Imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because their wishes aren't being granted. Oh, how delightful! They deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. If you, you know, want anything, all you need to do is ask me, princess. I can grant wishes. Of course I'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You watch yourself, Princess. You better not cause trouble. <laughs> Peach is like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, please. If only somebody could help me. <laughs> FBI, open up. Huh? To be fair, Peach, you're not in any real danger. You have a nice bed, you have a nice room, you're not in shackles. You're fine. What the hell is that? Hello, Princess Peach, pleased to meet you. My name is Twig. <laughs> Twig! You 
poor star. Why not twinkle? Like twinkle, twinkle, little star. Why is your name Twink? Oh, Lord. <laughs> okay, Twink. <laughs> but you're, you're a star kid, aren't you? How'd you get here? Okay, star kid. All right, listen. G Boogie. Just make, just make sure G Boogie isn't around. Don't tell G Boogie, but I'm going to use the baby voice for the star kid. Hopefully I'm correct, right? Hopefully I'm right and that it's an actual toddler and I can use that voice and it makes sense. But if I'm wrong, I am so sorry. So yeah, don't tell G Boogie I'm doing this. G Boogie's probably watching right now, giving me the death glare. About to unsubscribe from my channel. Oh, Alright, anyways. <laughs> I came from Star Haven to grant your wish. It's our job to grant wishes, you know? I I swear to God, if I'm not doing this character justice, I'm so sorry. <laughs> this might be the, fir the the only time, actually, that we see this character. So, yeah, if I, if I see the character again, or another star kid or something, then I'll switch up the voices. <gasps> You came because I wish that somebody could help me? Yes, of course. And yeah, so for those of you who missed the uh, the lost episode, I also changed Goombaria's voice, so don't worry. <laughs> oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right now and take that star ride back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do that? Mm, uh, sorry. That's a little much for a novice star like me. Maybe one of the honorable star spirits from Star Haven could grant a wish like that. What do you mean? I'm so sorry. Please ask for something easy. Something small star can do. <laughs> what? Then, can you take me away from here? Everyone in my castle has been captured and I have to save them all as soon as possible. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't grant that wish either, I'm afraid. You're useless! Useless! You suck! How do I kill a star? Is that possible? <sighs> you failed me. Twink. Actually, I just got called up to the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. That makes sense. If I were more spinach star, maybe I could actually help. Well, yeah, you're useless. Get out here, Twink. Never come back. It's all right. Don't be sad, Twink. No, let me be sad. Mario will definitely do something to save us all. He's probably coming right now. Well, Mario's coming, all right. Oh, Twink, do you think you can find Mario? I want you to give this to him. Uh-oh. Ooh. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Oh, okay. I'll do it, Princess Peach. I'll fly to your Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. Twink with the wink. Oh wait, Twink! Wait one second, can you also? Please tell Mario that. I'm fine and he shouldn't worry, okay? Can you tell him that? Aww. Of course, I'll tell him your exact words, Princess Peach. Definitely. Now don't despair. I'll be back soon, so stay safe until I return, okay? Yeah, get out of here, Twink. Useless star. Piece of garbage. <laughs> oh, why am I so mad today? <laughs> Mario, where are you? I am on an incredible journey right now. Hey, here we are. Oh. The stars are still fa Oh god, I thought I was about to die there. The stars are falling from the sky. He's a star man! Soaring through the sky! David Bowie, anyone? No? Okay. Alright. Ow! <laughs> oh, it's Twink, okay. Oh, sorry, sorry, so sorry! I'm in a huge hurry. You got here very quickly. Oh, it's... You're Mario, aren't you? Yeah, what do you want? You stupid little star! I think the stars have found you. <laughs> Even Goombario's like, what the hell? <laughs> How do you do? I'm Twink. Princess Peach asked me to bring something to you. Uh, yes. Here it is. Here. This is it. Take it. You got a lucky star. Ooh, okay. Screenshot. <laughs> a star-shaped pendant lets you use the action command. Huh? Interesting. That's your yucky star from Princess Peach. Now that's yours, you can use the action command. Oh, am I about to kill Gumbario? Choose the jump command and then decide which enemy you want to attack. Right, I am. I know that, so bada bing bada boom. Let's just start an enemy. The explanation of the action command will appear. Yep. Oh, right now, just before stomping the enemy. Press A the, at exactly this moment. 
Oh! <laughs> I like that. Okay. So this was in Super Mario RPG when I played a little bit of that. When you do, you'll increase the amount of damage you do. Okay, now let's this time, Gabar, you try to attack Mario. So can I block? Oh, right now. Press A just before the attack strikes you. Oh, <laughs> nice. I get it, I get it, I get it. You don't need to show me anything else to the left and release one. Oh, wait, what? P okay, wait a minute, this is new. Sure, let's practice a bit. Okay, let's see. All right, hammer. All right, hold back. Nice, got it. <laughs> die, Goombario, die, bonk. No. I pressed A! Too early. Okay, all right, hang on, hang on. Let's see. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Perfect, okay. So he actually has to land first, and then you count like half a second, and then you press A. Yeah, so it's not before he lands, it's when he lands. Okay, I got it, I got it. I know how this works now. Uh, in training. Okay. Alrighty. Once you understand how to use the action command properly, you'll be even more powerful. Terrific. You'll be much tougher in battle now. Here you are. Oh, here you are. Oh. Oh, no. Here you are! What? It can't be. W were you following me? Mm, what a foolish star kid! I knew that if I followed you, I'd find Mario. If I defeat Mario right now, I'll be famous! So, is this just normal Kamek? I think this is. Yeah, this isn't Kami Koopa. This is just Kamek. I'll tell Kami Koopa she'll shower me with praise. She'll give me a raise! <laughs> Here I come! Alright. Let's do this. Bring it on! Okay. So, first things first, let's tattle. Tattle. Magic Koopa. This is a Magic Koopa. Magic Koopas use magical rod. <laughs> Max HP, eight, attack power, three. Alrighty. Magic attacks are no joke, Mario. You better take these guys seriously. You got it. Okay. Uh, let's see. Can't use a hammer. That makes sense, because they're floating. Uh, jump. Let's do a power jump. All right, here we go. We gotta stick the landing. Boom! Oh, okay, I thought I messed it up, <laughs> actually. Nice. Oh, I blocked it! No way! I, <laughs> I actually didn't expect to block it. Alright, now hammer time. Let's, let's see it. Boom. Oh, it's so satisfying. Let's do a head bonk. Awesome. <laughs> That's how it's done! That feels so good! Yeah! Very nice. Very nice. That was awesome. Well done, Mario. You're as strong as they say. I know that you'll be able to defeat Bowser. I'm going to return your Princess Peach aside. Is this too loud? I gotta turn my game down just slightly. I'm not strong enough to really help her, but at least I can tell her you're okay. Well, Mario, see you later. Alright. Take care, buddy. Alrighty. Where, where are you going? What are you doing? Oh yeah, I almost forgot to tell you the message from Princess Peach. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get your feeling, though, that she's very lonely. Anyway, I'll do my best to help the both of you. But please be brave. You might save Princess Peach. That's the plan. Alright, thank you. Goodbye. There he goes. Back to Bowser's castle. What a brave little guy. Okay, Mario, let's get down to business. This is the voice I'm giving Goombario. <laughs> it probably does not fit, but... Hey, it's not the baby voice. Cool stuff, cool stuff. This game just keeps getting better and better. Let's keep trucking. Oh, hello. Oh, Mario! Merlon was looking for you. He lives in that house at the spinning roof. He asked me to tell you to go meet him at his house. I was just about to go look for you, but here you are. It's rare for Merlon to call somebody over to his house. He's a bit eccentric. Even when he has visitors, it's rare for him to come out of the house at all. Interesting. Okay, okay. All right, this is Merlon's house. Right, I remember... Oh, Merlin, never mind. But, but, you, why do you keep on knocking? I'm telling you, he's out. D dang. <laughs> what the? Why is someone sleeping in front of my house? Wait a minute. That face seems very familiar to me. <laughs> you just knocked me out. Oh, maybe. No. Yes, it must be. You're Mario. I've been waiting for you. You should have come earlier. Well, you're here now. Come in. Oh, 
okay. B -b 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 all right, Gumbario, phasing through the door. Where to begin? My name is Merlon. I am a wizard. When I was reading the stars the other day, an oracle came to me. What I discovered is very important, and it concerns you. But before I tell you about it, there are other things of which I must speak. It is a very long story, but I'll try to shorten it. Where should I start? It was in the old days. One of my ancestors was up on Shooting Star Summit, and as usual. But one day it happened. Suddenly, a great appeared and I, standing face to face. Then, the far away, the pious was, raised me up, was amazing. I was still so young then. I believed in, but our hearts were. Mm, and then, so, uh, meh. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> what is happening? What are you trying to say? Are you hypnotizing me? Mario's asleep now. Mario's fast asleep. This is so weird. Uh... And that is all that matters. Are you evil? Wait, what? Huh? Hey! Mario! Were you listening to me? Oh, okay. Oh, alright. So anyway, that is why I'm able to help you. If you get lost during your adventure, you can come to me. I can predict the path you should take for a small price. Is this guy... I don't know if I trust this guy. <laughs> right now, your main goal must be to save Princess Peach as quickly as is humanly possible. But, according to my second sight, your path must first take you to the great fortress of the Koopa Bros. To reach the Koopa Bros fortress, head east on the road in front of the tow town. Uh, oh, oh, okay, okay, I'll be leaving now. I could tattle you. Let me tattle you real fast. This is the central area of Toad Town, a plaza in front of Princess Peach's castle. Pleasant Patch begins to the east of here. This used to be a bustling area before Bowser's attack. Guests at the castle were always in and out, and, and tourists came from all over to see the castle. The wizard Merlon also lives around here. If you get stuck, his fortune telling must, might just help you out. Oh, okay. There's also a Toad House where you can take a short rest. A post office- Yeah, yeah. I, I know that much. I wanted to learn about him. I wanted you to tell me about him. Oh, okay. He's a stubborn and mysterious old man. His name is Merlon. He uses magical powers to look into the future. I've l listened to his stories before and they're really long. I try to pay attention, but sometimes I fall asleep. Still, his fortune telling is supposedly right on. I don't know personally, but my Goompa told me. Okay. Yeah, this is getting weird, man. This is getting very weird. I'm gonna save real fast. And we're gonna keep trucking. You guys were also telling me that I should check out the house on a regular basis because things usually change at the house. So I need to keep revisiting the house. So let's do it. <laughs> that failed. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Hey, Luigi. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna stop on by and see if anything changed. Yep, everything seems to be somewhat similar. Okay, that's all I needed. <laughs> all right, let's get out of here. Hello, you're blocking my path. Get out of my way. You don't want to go out there. It's all it's way too dangerous. Going to Cooper Bruce Fortress would be a huge mistake. Definitely, definitely don't go. Most of all, though, you shouldn't go ask old man Merlon for help. That would be really bad news for us. I mean, for you. Don't even think about it. I tattle you guys, though? He's a funny color for a toad, you know? I don't think I want, I want to know this guy. He, he looks like bad news. Uh, okay. Oh, what's this? Wait a minute. Hang on. Wait a second. A Mario. Do you want me to predict the path you should take? It'll cost five coins, if that is acceptable. Sure. Excellent. Now relax while I read what your future holds. Ooh, crystal eye, open wide. Ay, ay, cha, ay, 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 ching. Aha! <laughs> what is going on? What is this? What is this? <laughs> What is happening? This is so weird. Okay. You must journey to Koopa Bros Fortress. You can travel there by following Pleasant Path to the east of town. Okay. The path begins right next to D Toad's house. If you have any problems getting started, please don't hesitate to ask for my help. Right. I failed to understand that the first time. Thank you guys so much for watching part three of my Let's Play series of Paper Mario. Unfortunately, I had to cut this episode short. 
something came up that required my attention, so I couldn't record uh, as long as I usually do, so I really do apologize for that. But for part four, expect at least an hour long video. Uh, I'm gonna make so much progress, I'm very, very excited. I really love where the story is going. And yeah, so hopefully you guys are very excited as well. But nevertheless, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And as always, peace out guys, see you guys later, and yeah. Bye guys, see you guys soon.